Hi guys, today we'll create pattern design vector quality using artificial intelligence tools. Now we are at Hugging Face starting page. All the links you will require for this project you can find in description to this video. Pantone announced color of the year 2023 and its name is Viva Magenta. Everything looks happy, optimistic, but in case you plan to use it in your design, you must understand that any color have its influence in combination. So we need to find the most beautiful combination of colors where Viva Magenta used. In case you want exact digits, go to Designer Tools and you can see here are sRGB hex and lab codes that you can use in Adobe Illustrator. Now let's generate using artificial intelligence color palette for our project. Firstly we go to magic prompt stable diffusion. I click on this big button magic prompt and put our initial text floral lingerie in viva magenta color. Stable diffusion models are pre-trained on datasets and has no access to internet to check for news. That's why we need to write description of this color understandable for stable diffusion. Viva Magenta described as pink magenta or red magenta, so let's use this combination. Words order in sentence matters, so let's put magenta at the beginning, then I print pink and then red. In case I want more details, I need to specify what part of clothing to demonstrate. That's why I'll print panties and also we'll add more zoom with words close up. Now I'll press execute to generate magic prompt. As you can see at the right four different variants generated. Let's probably take third sentence. I copy it then switch to fine-tuned diffusion. Here is widget that gives possibility to generate image from text using additionally trained models enhanced models of stable diffusion. I'll select this one and enter prompt here. I uh, remove any artists so stable diffusion will work without any influence. Move the slider to right so four different variants will be generated. I also add front view to exclude backside shots. AI model decided to add personal colors, but we need Viva Magenta, so I remove any additional specifications. Cinematic lighting, it's good proposition. Trending on art station, Octane Render, Nvidia demo. I removed these phrases because do not want to achieve some kind of 3D model. Guidance scale. Let's move to 12. This will help stable diffusion to generate result closer to our prompt. And now let's press generate. Not bad. We achieved necessary result and I'll select second variant. I copy this image. Then I go to Adobe Illustrator, create new file, name it Pentis Seamless Ornament 001 and paste image into artboard. Let's gather some more samples. Go to Hugging Face and press Generate once more. Each time I press this button, I receive a new selection of images. Not bad. From these four images I'll select probably this one. So I copy and paste it to my collection. Let's proceed. Once more I'll press generate. From this selection probably I'll take this one and paste it here also. 
I made few more attempts and finally selected these six images. I think they give nice representation of color palette with Viva Magenta. At this moment I want to point out that all these images are not suitable for professional design because they have low quality and some mistakes in uh, human body representation and patterns, but such uh, approach gives us incredible possibility to quickly analyze preview of possible color palette and uh, make a choice from full color realistic images. The next step is to select only one that is the best and redraw it using vector instruments in Adobe Illustrator. It's quite difficult to select the best one, but it's necessary to do because we need to proceed. So I'll select lower left variant, delete other images and start working with this image. I'll specify color palette. I'll prepare a few swatches and fill them with colors from my image using color picker. My key color here is Viva Magenta, so I need to specify it correctly. Here is designer tool for color and I'll use hex code in my illustration. BE 3455. I'll print exact numbers here and there is exact representation of Viva Magenta color. At this point actually I make interpretation of color palette, how I personally feel it. When finished with colors, I'll analyze and interpret main forms of pattern. I see here two triangles. I'll create triangular form, copy it and mirror it. Here is central element of my pattern. Let's check proportions. Specified dimensions for my illustration. Then I prepare image to trace. I create additional layer in Illustrator. Name it Trace Me. Put copy of uh, my generated image to this layer. Then I change transparency to multiply and put image over my pattern. In the way elements uh, I want to trace will be organized according to geometry specified. When done I copy this image and put it for reference purposes near my tracing. And now I'll add more details in my personal geometrical style. I'll demonstrate this process in time-lapse episode. At this stage I create outlines for flowers to stress out forms. Then I remove outlines and uh, make fields with gradients that use Viva Magenta color inside. I created few flowers filled with gradients and now duplicate them to create fine composition elements. Such blocks of three and more flowers to compose pattern in the same way we see in image generated by stable diffusion. At this time I create simple form that mimics rose flower leaf. As you can see I add zigzag effect to achieve fine details. Also I fill leaves with gradients. Now you watch episode where blue flowers added 
When done, I combine leaves, red, viva magenta and blue flowers in composition elements and try to dislocate them in best possible manner according to reference image. Then I reflect three flowers from right to the left exactly in the same manner as at reference. And now I am ready to create pattern. I back up image and use pattern tool to locate elements using my personal view how pattern is dislocated. I make few attempts and finally select hexagonal composition. Some more additional steps. To create sample fill I designed flat style panties and fill them with my pattern. Very easy step because in Illustrator you can fill this pattern in the same manner you apply solid fill. Now it's time for panties decoration. Much simpler than generated image because I create design that demonstrates concept. Stripe at the top in the same manner as rose leaves contours created with zigzag tool. And finally page design. Here located main pattern. Sample of usage woman body in panties in simple way. Big solid fill swatch for Viva Magenta color and some texts. Here is my final design. This pattern have vector quality, so it can be enlarged to any size without loss of quality because created by formulas. Also pattern is seamless, so you can stitch it on real material, on real clothes and achieve professional quality design for lingerie dress and so on. Also the whole page is designed in the manner suitable to be presented to client in the best possible way. If you enjoy this tutorial don't forget to like it. I demonstrate you the whole process of pattern creation using text prompt, AI generation, concept and final design in Illustrator. When I finished editing this video, I received an email that Illustration received the first sale on deposit photos. A pleasant moment confirming its commercial potential. I believe this demonstration will be helpful to your personal project in business and creativity. With best wishes, Andrew Tutsevich.